Alrighty. What's up, guys? Flame Saber here, and we're back for guys. some more Chrono Cross. On our last episode, we just we did quite a lot today, and we just got out of the Viper, we escaped the Viper's Manor, but Kid is out right now. And, and you really think that we're not going to save Kid? We are going to save Kid will be saved regardless, even though whether you say yes or no. Trust me. And the reason why you would definitely want to say no, because I want to get my boy Glenn. Glenn's my boy. So let's get out of here. Meet up with Macho. Are you ready? Okay then, let's get going. All of you get on the boat. That thing out of here right now. Hmm? Hmm? You got a problem with that? You don't see any other boats needing to dock, do you? That's not the point. What I'm trying to say is. Ah, cut the jive talk! Yes, ma'am. Okay, we're in Termina. Do what you need to do. Glenn should be somewhere around here. I think he's around the flower area, I think. Oh, there he is, right there. I see him. The general and his men are headed to Fort Dragonia. There has been word that the major power of the East, poor, is something, is up to something suspicious. I've heard of that area port and Chrono Trigger. They seem to have heard the rumors of the frozen flame in El Nido and are coming to investigate. My, then that means that poor Ari might invade this town at any time now. I wonder if we'll be alright. Yes. That is why we are moving to the fort for a while. That fort is far from town, so it is not used normally, but it has good defenses. I was ordered to remain at the manor and protect Miss Riddle, but she felt very uneasy about the way General Viper was acting before he left, so... What are you going to do? Are you going to get in trouble if you leave the manor? Yes, I still cannot stop thinking about it. So I'm planning to infiltrate the fort by boat. Are you sure about that? If worse comes to worse, you might be discharged from the Alicia Dragoons. Yes, I will act in accordance with my fate, even if I had to break military regulations. I must go, ma'am. I will come back to buy flowers from you when I return. Take care. Whoa, climbing up from here and jumping up here. Huh, wow. Didn't think you could go from here like that. Come back here, Glenn. You're not going anywhere, boy. I'm gonna head home soon, but what you're gonna do now? I don't know what happened ten years ago, 
Well, what's going on now? But don't you want to get things straight? Or do you want to live somewhere in peace and quiet? Attaboy! I knew you wouldn't give up. Life is a journey. Find yourself. That's how everyone grows up. So, where do we go to find... So, sorry. So where do we go to find out what's going on? What? So you say we need to go after Lynx and General Viper at Fort Dragonia? Did you hear? Fort Dragonia is a ruin of the extinct Dragonians. People say that they conducted ceremonies and most folks of Go Goldov don't go near the place. You gotta wonder what they're up to with the Dragon Tear there. It gives me the chills. Also, you've got to go through Mount Byer to get to that fort. You're gonna need it. You're gonna need to get there by boat. I know. You can borrow this boat. Just a little farewell gift for me. Don't worry. That brass, that brass son of mine, ain't not gonna use it for anything anyway. Hey, Glenn, get over here. I need to borrow a boat. Oops, you're just a look. You're just a tad too late. I just lent this boat to someone else. Ask this boy here. I need to borrow a boat. I'm trying to get to Fort Dragonia. Fort Dragonia? Well, what a coincidence. These kids here have business there too. But what business takes you to Fort Dragonia? And that red bandana is similar to the one by the ghost Karsh was talk telling me about. Ah, you city folk try to make things too complicated. That's got nothing to do with you, right? This poor boy's got his own problems too. Why don't you ask him his story to pass the time while you're traveling? Uh, uh yes. I guess you're right. So what would it be? Yeah! What you doing, boy? Get over here! Thank you. I have a suggestion before heading to the fort. When we get on the boat, first head north, then east, you should find a small island there. A retired Master Dragon Knight of the Dragoons named Radius lives there now. When me and my big brother were young, we used to, he used to look after us quite often. We should go to his advice before going any further. There are many frightful rumors about that fort. Who knows what to expect there? Yeah! Glenn! Get your butt in here, boy! Yeah! Let's go, Glenn! Get in here! I'm a little worried about you. Do you want me to come along? Yeah, sure. But you're not coming in. Let's get that right. No. Then I'll be heading home. That mischievous son of mine is probably starving. Be careful out there. If you ever need something, stop by Gold Off anytime. Look at her swimming. All right, let's go, Glenn. Welcome, boy. Yeah, with Glenn in the group, well, I'll show you a little something when we get in the battle. Let's get to our weapon shop and see what we got to, to buy for Glenn, since we don't have any swords, really. Find some iron, really do.
wait a minute. Oh yeah, wait a minute. She has to special it when not. Let me go to a safe point. And unequip her. Let me get to a world map. Ice 
want that will be Can't afford magnifier. Well, I, can, yeah, I can't really afford magnifier at this point because it's level six. Plus, sweet and heal bomb, double sweet. Fire pillar, yep. Aqua ball, yep. Burn, yeah, boy. Let's see, what we got? Yep, there we go. We got it. All right, get some cure blessings. Get some heal bomb. Fire pennies. Aqua ball. Yep. And upheavals. Yep. I guess all the stuff I bought, the 
we're gonna have to wait till we get some more stars. About more bosses. But at least we're prepared. Oh well. Maybe we can get another spatula. Another weapon for her. Um, another weapon. Let's see. Dang, man. Do I seriously need a... F do I seriously need to find another... I really gotta find that iron. I really do. I don't want to be desperate, because it's a really good accessory item. And this too. What's this silver pendant that we have here? We really need to find an iron. We really do. Alright. I guess let's just move on now. Let's get to a boat. Yeah, we need to get to a battle and get some iron. Let's go.
set. Found it. No, that's not it. That's, um... That's, I know this house, but this isn't the house we want. This isn't the area we want. What on earth happened? Could Lynx have done this? That's correct? Hmm, maybe not. Oh, Harley. See, correct answer is, I did this under Monsieur Lynx's orders. Salute, Flame Saber. Did you miss moi? Harley, what have you done with Radius? Ooh la la, Glenn, you're all fired up. Ooh. Tell me! Tsk, tsk, tsk. Excuse me, excuse me, Flame Saber, but do you want to know why I burned the place to the ground? Yeah. Well, first of all, is to teach you our lesson. And second of all, is to get rid of the geezer who lives here. He is an ally of the Alicia Dragoons, and I hear he's quite skilled. I was disappointed to see that the Gita isn't here. I wonder where he went. One more thing, Flame Saber. Monsieur Lee give moi another order. That that is to slow down your pursuit. Here I go. Okay, gotta fight Harley. Ethan, take all the time you wish. Oh, I will. Oh, that's some damage. We can lead us out. All right, Glenn, let's go, boy. Oh my gosh, that hurts. Between Glenn and I, we can use the X-Strike. Well, however, Glenn, you're in danger of life, so we're gonna heal you up. You need some help. Almost dead. Uh oh, who is it? Search. That's all right. All right, double tech skill go. Extract. Ah, not good enough to kill you, huh? Mind you. Moi is the CT. Oh, yeah, we got her. Yeah, let's go. Extra goo. But no star. Yeah, photon beam. Let's go. Mm -hmm. 
Ooh la la, you are you really strong. Trace forth, Flame Saber. Well, that's all the fun for today. Au revoir, Flame Saber. Are you one of Lynx's minions? Radius, you're safe. Oh ho, ho, is that you, Glenn? It's been a while. You seem well. I'm glad that you are right. Yes. Miss Riddle informed me that Lynx and the General were heading to Fort Dragonia. I played it safe and went into hiding for a while. And it looks like Lynx did pay me a visit. I'm sure the General has no idea what happened here. Lynx is the one behind all this. I had a feeling something like this might happen. That's why I made sure I built a sturdy stronghold underground. I believe you should be in, still be intact. Lynx must be plotting something. By the way, Glenn, who are these people? Oh, they are... Well, no sense in standing out here. Please come in. Hmm, I see. All right. Yeah, let's go, Botan Bean. Eh, uh, we can give a people here. It has to be here, right, right here. Full Tom Bean's one of my favorites. Oh, oh crap, I did not mean to skip through this. I thought it was a didn't know it was a real scene. My bad. However, Dario is no longer with us. Life is so unpredictable. It was then that Link approached General Viper. He spoke of the legendary treasure, the frozen flame, which is able to heal all illnesses and fulfill any dreams. I do not know what is this man links his plotting, but I believe General Viper intends to overthrow the nation of Poor with the power of this legendary jewel. Poor is a nation governed by militarism. It has brought suffering to many people on the central continent of Zidan. Perhaps the General envisions a bright and peaceful world just like Guardia was one at the time. Or is he planning to find the answer as why we have continued to hurt and kill each other once antiquity? In any case, I no longer wish to involve myself in any conflicts. Besides, there is no way I won't want to face General Viper in battle. Young one, should you plan to engage a battle with Lynx, beware, he's a fearsome man. I suggest you rest here for the night and leave in the morning. There are many cursed spirits wandering around the seas around here. Rumor has it that they attack the ships and suck the souls out of humans. I think I know which ship you're talking about.
about radius. But we do need to find a spot where we can find some iron. Like I said. Well, we're pulling back, yeah. Let's find the spot where we can find some iron. Uh, I really need to find some bad. Tom Beam Attack!
There's the iron. There it is. But I'm pretty sure there's more we can find around here. Another iron. Sweet! is good and all. Especially getting her final tech skill is pretty hard from what I'm hearing. But if you get Razzly, I can't get Glenn. She's a green though. But I like Glenn better. And she's, I always say she's definitely one of the characters that can actually, um, you give you a, um, triple tech skill alongside with Lena. thing is, we got some iron. Huh, I, f I forgot about you. Let's go. Come on. Come on.
I don't know what it is. There it is. Weapon shop. There we go. What? Nothing here that requires an iron? stuff here. or something. Oh, man. 
man, missing surge. I steal them. What? Get the poison. Cover all.
Uh oh, wasn't that? Dead yet? Frozen! Got him. Finish him. Yeah! Barely made it. Good job.
Bushwhacker. 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 It's a little martyrdom attack. Are you alright, Flame Saber? The toxin seems higher than higher here than the entrance. The plants must have mutated. Got some protective gear. All right, let's get out of here. We're through. We're through here. Could this be the ghost ship? Well, what are we waiting for? You are right. We will not be able to navigate our boat in this fog. Doesn't seem like a ghost ship to me. 
pirates! Who are you? Make way for Captain Fargo! You seem to be the young ones. You seem to be the young one. Sorry, sorry. You seem to be a bit young for one of Link's subordinates. Ah, well, who cares? What do you want from us? That's up to you. But first things first. What's your intention? Don't play stupid. Don't play stupid. We know you're trying to get to Mount Pyre. We saw General Vipers and Link's ships anchored nearby. Are you trying to deliver them a message? Is that it? No, no. No, no, no. You are mistaken. We're actually after them. They're our enemy. Enemy. Huh? Are you serious? Explain yourselves. I see. So that explains why you're after Lynx. But, don't you know you're risking your lives? Don't you, don't you recognize the danger associated with Lynx? He's a monster. A cool-blooded monster. An incarnation of death. To be frank with ya, we had our share shares of encounters with Lynx too. But, that was a long time ago. Ever since then, we'd had to disguise ourselves as this ghost ship. So if you're gonna face Lynx, eh? That's easy to say, but... Huh? But what? Huh? Arr! Bring out our you-know-what. Aye, aye, Captain Bargo. I just want to see if you youngsters can match up to the likes of Lynx. Just making sure you're not all talk. Looks like they're ready. Let's see what you can do. Just loosen y'all up. Time to get serious. Polly!
I don't think that's a star, though. Oh, it is a star. Cool. Magma burst. Yeah. than I expected. You got me blood boiling. I'm next. Dolly ho, up and at him. Not good enough to kill him yet. Oh, wait, you got him? Now that's smarts. Yeah, we did it before we used Carnivore. Cause that would have sucked. Really, really bad. But we got him. Not bad, but keep in mind we be pirates. Flame Saber! It's the Tranquilizer we made from Jellybish. You lovers will be asleep for a while. Yeah, he knocked our butts out. Well, that's that. Arg, stick these land lovers in the hold. Are you all right, Flame Saber? You don't look so well. Be on your guard. There's something going on outside. Ah, 
Outstanding watch ain't easy. What's up with the fog today? I can't even see the water out here. I, I ain't scared. Arrgh! Something's up. Yes, there it is. Bone and iron, cool. What are these monsters? What are these monsters doing here? What's going on?
sorry, sorry. Yeah, I'm back. And for the record, I did work out the other day. And man, do I feel pretty sore from a big one. And man, I am moving around like freaking Bowser from Smash Melee. Super Smash Bros. Melee, to be more exact. Oh, looks like they have nothing against the likes of us. So what's that? What is that going on? for you.
fire pillar. Locked. What? Gotta get a turn. Ooh, that hurts a bit. How did you guys get out? Ah, forget it. We have more serious matters to worry about. Aye, mateys, who's on key duty? Oh, I am. You want the key to the door downstairs, eh? There you go. Well, that was pretty simple. Cool. We 
got the key. It helps all. Okay, you can still battle you even though we're climbing down. Wow.
save point up there. There's Pip. One I just kind of unlocked the door. Hey Pip, hey, get back here. Stop running. Why do you keep approaching me? Can't you see I'm hiding? Huh? You wanna know why I'm here? I'm a stowaway. I desperately want to see the sea. When I woke up, there are monsters all over the place. It really scared me. Anyway, I want to see the world because of my life. I'm walked up in, the, in a web. Can you bottom my build of the world? Thank you very much. Uh, 
Out. Too many of them. Art. Oh crap. Ah. Oh. Captain, look out. Damn. Matey, go help the captain. Get your stinking ghostly hands off me. Go take the wheel. Aye, aye, Captain. I'm counting on you. Keep your head high, matey. Don't forget, we be pirates aboard the SS Invincible. Man your stations. It's time to show these monsters what we're made of. Aye, aye, Captain. Flamesaver, keep your head high. They're coming. All fused together to form a big one.
Are we boo? Oh, we're just cursed. for us. And now we unlock element level 5 for everybody. That's the direction where the second tech skill will be. Looks like the sea is back to normal. You said you're heading for Fort Dragon Noah, right? To go out to Viper's men? Let me give you some advice. Mount Pyre is a fiery hell. Without any protection against fire, you'll lose strength fast. I suggest you see the water dragon for its divine protection first. Although I haven't heard much about him recently, I wonder if the dragon's still alive. Actually, I haven't heard much of the other dragons either. And these dragons we just beat, what's going on nowadays? I tell ya. Even the sea seems to have changed its nature. It's probably because we human folks have to come around. He <laughs> Didn't think pirates had a sentimental side. And the name of Davy Jones, what have we done? Check on kid. I think at this point, kid should be better or something. I'm not sure. Let's check on her. Kid, do not tell me she. Wait, no, it's a joke. It's a look. Wait, she's all better. Flame Saber, it's not your fault. She's all better. See. What are you all? 
What are you guys all doing there? Boy, it's been a while, eh? But what's with the astonished look on your faces? Huh? What? Where was I? Oh, I complain about this stupid gown. But when they hit me... I complain about this stupid gown. But then they hit me on clothes somewhere to stop me from trying to escape. So I had no choice but to take a walk around a village looking like this. Anyway, what's up with you guys? Did you come back because you were worried about me? Heh, <laughs> I ain't gonna drop dead from a wacko from a week of poison like that. I guess it was a pretty close call this time, eh? <laughs> but how did you naturalize the poison? Sorry, I haven't the foggiest idea either. The doc will be back this afternoon. Let's ask him then. You're here to ask me how I was able to naturalize the poison. Yeah, there's nothing to lose by knowing how, right doc? It was a coincidence, no. It was probably an act of fate. After you left the village, a young man came to visit me upon hearing the patient's condition from a villager. He had brought a certain item with him. A certain item? You don't mean... Yes, it was Hydra humor. He happened to have a vial with, it with him at the time. Hey Doc, who was that guy? Do we at least know his name? I'm sorry. I do not know. He only told me that he came from the mainland. Came from the mainland? At least give him a chance. I... Wait, I thought I heard something. Hmm, sorry. Came from the mainland? At least give me a chance to thank him. Jeez. I hate being in debt to others. Ah, hell. When I find them, I'll... Wait, that's not what I want to do. That's all, that is all I know. In the end, I proved useless as a doctor. It's not something I could be forgiven, but I offer my apologies. Hey, wait, Doc. What's with the formality? No matter what happened, you're the one who made the answer, all right? It would have been useless without you. Yeah, we have the right stuff. Okay, I think I better. The reason why I'm lowering my voice because it is late and I don't want to make any disturbances. So maybe I should kind of lower it down. So probably no voice acting from here because we got to end the stream soon.
yeah, we remember that thing where we fought Lynx.
it back, and that's gonna be the stream. Alrighty, well, it's getting late. Time to hit the hay. But I will see y'all later. Peace out.